Hey everybody, we've been doing hip activation every day and I want to break down two movements uh, that we've been getting a lot of questions about. The first one is a curtsy squat. So we're going to put, my athlete's going to put his hands on his hips. We're going to start loading up the left leg. He's going to take a big step back with his right leg. Good. And then he's going to cross the right leg behind. Now hold that for a second, buddy. So you can see he's crossed. His knees are pretty much in line. That back foot is outside, is lined up with the opposite hip. Right, so if I'm here, my hips, right foot's underneath the left, I'm going back and I'm putting that right foot across that left opposite hip, right? He's going to go down and up. And what this does, it really allows you to fire up your glutes just using body weight. Do two more. One more. Good. And he's going to stand up tall. The second one we do is a plie squat. So we're going to step just outside our hip line, so just slight, a little bit wider than our hips. Go ahead. Toes slightly out. He's going to go up on his heels, all right? Or sorry, up on his toes. <laughs> go up on his toes, arms up in the air. He's going to drop down, so his butt drops nice and low. And come up, arms up in the air. Do two more. One more. Good. Now he's going to do it one more time with his heels down. Go ahead, heels down. Same exact exercise. Good, and what that does, fires up your groin, your adductors, your glutes, get your legs going before you start doing sprints.